As many elementary and high school students in Alberta return to class, several post-secondary students have no choice but to go the virtual route, which some are finding more stressful. I feel overwhelmed, definitely. Anit Brar is an international student from India. The 21-year-old moved to Edmonton two years ago to attend Nate's biomedical engineering program. Since COVID hit, she's not been able to go back home to see her family. Like three years or even one year is a long time to look up to, to be able to see someone. So just the uncertainty of the time scares me a lot. Two weeks into school, with the majority of her classes only being offered online, Anit finds learning from home difficult. There's so many distractions. There's, and I, You're going to procrastinate. There's no way you can be so focused on something, especially when you're home. Procrastination is not the only issue. It's tough when you're at home all the time, focusing on school, you're stressed out, you don't have many people to talk to, you don't have an outlet to like get get school off of your mind and focus on something else. Nate's Student Association says there are some who for safety reasons prefer virtual learning, but they tell us many want to go back to class. A lot of people do want to be in person. I feel like classes will be easier when you have a question for an instructor. It's easier just to put your hand up and they can come to you. For Anip, it's also about interacting with classmates. Now she does have one in-person lab where everyone has to be six feet apart while wearing a face mask and shield. That distance and you know the, how you have to do things in a new way, just not really comforting for me right now. I'm getting used to it. It'll take time, definitely. From Edmonton, Sherolta Saskew, City News.